Hi, my name is Albie Miller. I'm the co-president of Phoenix Closures. And in this video, we're going to talk about one of the three facets of induction, which is uh, torque. You have pressure, heat, and time. And by pressure, I mean the torque application of the closure onto the land of the bottle. Heat, meaning the directional energy, which is caused from the induction unit itself. And time, which is the speed of the conveyor. There is a sweet spot for torque. A good starting point is half the diameter of the closure. So today we have a 70 millimeter and we're gonna run and do the test at 35 inch pounds of torque. We're gonna compare that to an under torqued closure. So we're gonna do the next bottle at six inch pounds of torque. And then we're going to run the same energy settings on the induction unit, which we've established is 70% energy usage is yielding a really great seal. We use a meter similar to the one in front of us, which is a digital torque meter to determine the correct inch pounds of torque that we can apply the cap to. And so what we do uh, to do that is we wind up cranking this down to secure the package. We just hit the reset button and then we twist it and then using the digital meter to get or establish 35 inch pounds of torque. We finished inducting the two bottles at the different torque levels. Let's go ahead and start with the uh, 35 inch pound torqued cap that, that was done at 70% energy. And to, so we're getting a nice, strong, aggressive bond, and it peels well, but it's fully sealed all the way around the bottle. Whereas if we're at the six inch pound, which is under torqued, but it was done at the same energy, what you're gonna find is it just comes right off. There's no aggressive bond. This is something that would be inconsistent in the marketplace and be a liability. Here at Phoenix Closures, we're committed to our products and we wanna make sure that you're getting the most out of your package. So please, if there are any questions, feel free to reach out to us. We're happy to help. Thank you very much.